thrifty guys today I just want to show you how to save the most money while you're shopping at Amazon one of the things I first like to do I'm in Amazon Prime uh, do subscribe to that membership yearly it's about $99 a year and if you, you use it a lot it's probably worth your money what I like to do is first start out at the subscribe and save page So just click, type that in at the search box, and then hit the button here. So you want to make sure that this drop-down menu right here is in the search. And we're going to search for water filter, refrigerator water filters. And specifically, I'm going to narrow this down. It doesn't look like they have mine, but you can see right here that you can save some money, about 5%. If you go through their subscribe and save program, you're not likely going to get it right away like the uh, Prime 2-day shipping offers. But if you're willing to wait some time, you could save some money, extra money. And also with the subscribe and save, if you off put it 5 items in your cart through that program in the same month, you can save 15 percent on that whole the whole purchase which is that's pretty good savings so I see my filters that I want to purchase another thing to keep in mind with these is especially with water filters the more you buy the more you're gonna save so with this it's it's pretty good savings it's probably about $12 so I generally buy the two pack for these because you know I switch them out twice a year so $12 savings is pretty good I'm just gonna go ahead and add that to my cart and then if you do have an Amazon Rewards card, you can save another 3% on all your purchases, which I do, but I'm going to do something else with my, as I go to check out here. If you also have a Discover card, you can use your cashback rewards here. And so I'm going to use that. You note right here I have $13 on here so I'm going to use the max on it and it also helps to go ahead and look for any promo codes out there that you may be able to use with your purchase um, retail me not there's a lot of other websites out there that can give you some promo codes to use at Amazon so it's worth checking out you as you can apply those here too So it just pays to, if you're going to buy in bulk, that you can save money in that way. And also with the uh, no rush shipping, since I'm with Prime, I can do the two day. But if I choose no rush, I can get a dollar credit for ebooks and other digital music and videos. But today, I'm just going to go ahead with the order as it's placed. Uh, it comes out to $50. So. Not too bad. 